All right, well, we're finally ready to apply the paint shop. There's a lot of little fine details that we need to take care of before we lay down the paint. Now, what I did was uh, I went, th went through and I blew the entire car off with the air gun. Uh, Brian and I went through and wiped the entire car down with the prep spray. One last final thing to do is we need to go and wipe down the entire car with a tack, cl tack cloth. And what that is, is it's, it's a, almost like a sticky rag that wipes all the little lint and any little last bit of dust that you might have missed uh, that pick, picks that up. And whenever painting with Paint Shop or any bulk paint, you're going to want to use a respirator because it's very important. We do have a filtered system within the paint booth here, but you definitely want to have a respirator. Finally, with the spray gun, we have an HVLP gun here. HVLP stands for high volume, low pressure. So with this gun, you're going to need about 15 to 20 PSI to paint, and that's all. A regular conventional spray gun can be used as well with Paint Shop. Uh, with that, you're going to use maybe about 30 to 40 pounds, but it also depends upon the spray gun. So always, you know, you're going to want to spray like a piece of cardboard, some sort of test panel to make sure, and you're going to want to do all your adjustments on that piece of cardboard as well before you start spraying on the body. Uh, what else we got to do? Well, we are in a nice uh, enclosed paint booth. We keep, we're keeping all the dust outside, but we are in a warehouse, and uh, the ground that we're on here is a little bit dirty. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw some water down, keep that dust from floating around, because the last thing we want is dust on our paint job. Yeah, definitely. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with that. I already started a little bit, but I'm going to finish that up so we can get going. And I'm going to go mix the paint up. laying down some paint but a quick technique I want to tell you about when you spray the paint when you go down you're going to start from the top down so you're going to spray same spray in the fender start from here work the way to the right stop at the break of the panel and work your way back you're going to want to overlap your color each time so you don't get a lot of stripes so you're going to slightly overlap so it's even coverage from the top down you're also going to want to hit all your hard to reach areas first so you're not bending over the car and rubbing up you know your suit against the paint so I'm going to hit the, the back side of the header panel first and the back side of the fender first and then I'll work my way from the top down. Okay, well, uh, we do have some tight quarters in here in our paint booth, and unfortunately when we were painting the door, when we opened it to get the door jam, our pant leg hit the side of the car here and messed up our paint job slightly. But the great thing about paint shop is we can come in here, sand it down like I did, I used some 600 grit, feathered it out, and then uh, give it a couple hours, and then uh, we can go ahead and paint it again. So I just finished, Brian's going to get the gun ready, and uh, pretty soon we're going to paint this again, you'll never even know it was here. 